Hi, are all your thoughts and emotions occupied by someone? It seems like a crush, but it feels so intense that you can't stop thinking about it or even stalking them. You're attracted to them, but you realize it's taking a toll on other aspects of your life. According to the American Psychological Association, an unhealthy obsession often stems from underlying insecurities, childhood trauma, anxious attachment style, or a need for control. Also, it can be linked to seeking validation or filling a void in your life through someone else. So, you have an unhealthy obsession with someone. Now what? The first step to fixing the problem is acknowledging it. To deal with an unhealthy obsession, it's important to first understand the signs. Here are the signs to watch out for. You can't stop thinking about them. You feel anxious when you're not around them. You can't live without them. You neglect your needs to focus on them. You spend hours stalking them on social media and show up uninvited to places you think they might be. Obsessive feelings can become unhealthy when they affect your well-being and other relationships. They would make you do things you wouldn't normally do, affecting your growth, self-esteem, and productivity. Here are a few tips to help you deal with an unhealthy obsession. Know you're worthy of love. Obsessions can come from you feeling undeserving or thinking you've missed out on love. You can convince yourself that you're unlovable and won't find someone who truly cares. The key is to look into these doubts. Ask yourself, why do I feel unlovable? Why do I believe this person doesn't love me the way I want? Once you understand, focus on loving yourself, imperfections included. Remind yourself of your worth daily and know that you're worthy of love. Get clear on what they mean to you. When you're obsessed with someone, try to find out what they mean to you. Ask yourself, what does this person represent? Is it acceptance, security, love, or understanding? Then, think about whether your experiences with them have fulfilled your emotional needs. Oftentimes, the answer is no. Embracing this reality can help you deal with unhealthy obsessions effectively. Take a reality check. Take a moment to consider if the perception of this person aligns with who they truly are. Have there been instances where your hopes didn't match reality? What lessons can you draw from those moments? Reflecting on these questions would help you understand that your obsession isn't based on reality, but an idea of them you created. Think about their flaws. Think about their not-so-great qualities. Everyone has flaws, even the person you're obsessing over. Realizing this helps you see them more clearly. It might not seem simple, but making a list of all their negative traits can give you a fresh perspective. Remember, this doesn't mean they're a bad person or unworthy of love, but it's a way to make sure you're looking at them as regular humans. If you don't know their flaws well enough, you might not really know them well enough to love them. Finding these insights helpful? Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Seek professional help. If your obsession with someone is affecting the overall quality of your life, Reaching out to a professional would be a good idea to determine if medical help is needed. While talking to loved ones can offer support, if you have an extreme obsession with someone, professional help would be the best solution. Lastly, don't forget to be kind to yourself throughout the process. It's okay to have strong feelings for someone, but when it becomes overwhelming and obsessive, it's important to take steps to address it. Understand that obsessions are based on your idea of them and not reality. Take small steps, be patient with yourself, and reach out for professional support when needed. You deserve a healthy and fulfilling love life. Have you experienced any of these signs? How did you overcome an unhealthy obsession? Share your experiences in the comments below. Curious about the signs of an unhealthy obsession? Watch this video to learn more. 7 Signs You're Obsessed With Your Crush